Hey everyone, my name is Brenna. I'm a missionary with The Culture Project, and today we're gonna to be talking about rejection. When I was in college, I witnessed a lot of my guy friends ask women out and not get a proper response in return. They would get a yes that would later turn into a no. And ultimately, these moments would leave them feeling discouraged to even pursue someone in the first place. You might be thinking to yourself, I can't just say no to him because it will hurt his feelings but I'm also not interested in dating him. Although it might hurt him to reject him, ultimately this is what we have to do as women. Men, you are worthy of a clear answer and rejection. You have done your job in stating your intentions and it is only fitting that we receive the same clarity in response. Ladies, when we are clear with our no, it allows the men in our lives to see that we respect them enough to be honest with them. So some practicals. First and foremost, affirm their masculinity by thanking them for their courage to asking you out, for expressing their interest in you. Woohoo! Asking someone out is hard. As women, we rarely have to go through the process of putting ourselves out there. This is why it's so important that we affirm their boldness in pursuing us, even if we don't reciprocate feelings. Second, be clear in your response. Stay away from phrases like, I'm not in a place to date right now. When we are not clear in our responses, oftentimes men are left confused. They are unsure whether or not to continue to pursue you. When we are clear with our no, men are able to understand that we are not interested and that they should move on. Third, in the case of needing to pray about it, it is important that you give him a time boundary. Saying something like, I'm not sure, but I'd like to pray about it, but I will get back to you by the end of the week. This ensures that he isn't waiting around forever and you're not just using prayer as an excuse to get out of a date. Lastly, be sensitive to his response. He might need some space after being rejected. As women, it's easy to use friendship as a consolation prize after rejecting someone, but we have to be careful not to take advantage of his vulnerability. Hopefully these practicals will help you navigate through your dating life and take one step closer towards your vocation. Thanks so much for watching. Be sure to subscribe and check out more content like this at thecultureproject.org.